Hey, hello everybody, it's me Cyber Soldier, and welcome back to another Malware video. In today's video, we will take a look at the malware called ClutterTech, created by Heizen. Shout out to him. This is a private malware which was developed for this specific video. Well, that's why it's called after me. Makes sense. This is the first malware which contains references about me, Cyber Soldier aka Clutter. Well, that has been said, and now let's mention something very important. Just quick interruption. Before we get into the video, please consider subscribing to my channel. I spent many hours working on these videos and we are also very close to 20,000 subscribers. So please, if you like my content and you don't want to miss future videos, subscribe to my channel. It's for free and you can change your mind whenever you want. Thank you very much. Alright guys, so I also want to show you the GitHub page which this creator gave me. Here you can find like all information about this malware. So yeah, this is a GDI malware that can destroy your device. This is also a malware about clutter tech. Alright, here's the creator. We all know that. Well, apparently this is a horror trojan. I I wonder what makes this malware really scary. Well, we will see. There are a lot of references from my videos. We will try to find them, of course. And yeah, here are some features as well, such as a master boot corruption. I guess we are all familiar with that. I don't really have to explain it here. All right, it even has file encryption via AES. So, well, that's what most uh, ransomware uses. You know this this algorithm for encrypting files and lastly we got gdi well i'm a little bit afraid of that word because nowadays gdi malware sucks you know let's be honest to you guys let's be honest but hey maybe maybe this malware is actually worth of trying you know we will see we should definitely run, run it on windows 11 that's what i'm going to do although we can use it on windows 10 but you know i really want to be sure that i'm running this malware like correctly so yeah, we will stick with Windows 11. Yeah, that's it. That's all the information I've got for you. Of course, there are some screenshots, but I really don't want to spoil anything. You know, I don't want to ruin the video <laughs> just like that. So let's move to the VM and see what we got. All right. So I guess we are ready to test this malware. There's even my character. Are you familiar with that? Guess you are. It's me, Cyber Soldier. All right. So my Windows Defender is disabled, I hope. And I hope my audio is also muffled because this malware contains probably some some intense sounds you know and i really don't want to like blow my ears off so yeah just in the case let's keep the volume quiet and i guess we can run it well i forgot about one thing which are properties of course so you can see here that this malware is a quite a large file and it's because it contains some resources you know those like references we will get into that hey everyone it's me cyber soldier yeah guys hey hello everybody i guess we Without further ado, let's actually get into the malware, shall we? I'm really curious what is gonna happen. Uh, let's let's try it. Let's give it a shot. Just in the case we got the warning. Hello, Cyber Soldier. I just realized this is malware and Cyber Soldier can destroy your computer without even elevation. Continue. Oh, this will bring us to the last warning, of course. <laughs> You're gonna. <laughs> Bro, just fix your grammar, all right? I I'm not sure if this was done for a purpose. Nah, this is horrible, bro. <laughs> fix your grammar. Fix your grammar. You are gonna actually fuck up your device if you press yes. By the way, not for the epileptic and shout out to Cyber Soldier or clutter tech for making this project possible like the voice lines and assets thank you so much still continue resulting in an unstable machine all right this is a pretty serious warning not gonna lie to you guys yeah but the grammar is a little bit off um, yeah well, let's be honest that's really interesting that we even like got the my username which is cyber soldier let's check it yeah, it's actually my new username and here's the current daytime which is nice nice detail all right so let's get into the malware Oh, my hey, background got changed. Soldier, and today I will be destroying your computer. All right, guys, I didn't say this. <laughs> it was the malware. Oh, what, what is happening with my mouse? Look at this. It's shaking. It is shaking so quickly. Jesus Christ, it's so intense. All right, so now we are now we are getting a bunch of GDI effects. That's what I expected. After all, this is a GDI malware. All right, so what we can do right now at this point, uh, can we access uh, some applications? For example, the registry editor. Can we actually open it? It seems that we cannot. All right, so now we are getting a bunch of icons. That's nice, I guess. What else will happen? Oh, thanks God that my audio isn't that loud, man. Otherwise, it would probably destroy my ears all right 
Oh no, yeah, what a classic. All these malwares do this. Task manager has been disabled by your administrator. I, I cannot even read this, like, those effects really doesn't allow me to read anything on my desktop right now. Jesus Christ. All right, let's click on OK, I guess. I guess we are good, guys. There's nothing we can do at this point. I'm wondering what is gonna happen. I, I don't- I'm tired of these effects, all right? I'm just tired of these effects. I would like to see something else. Will I get any jump scares? That would be crazy, man. If I got jump scared buddies malware, that would be really crazy. Um, like, you know, I, I'm still not afraid of anything. I'm- all right. I don't really know what to say about this one, bro. Let's be honest to you guys. I don't really like this one, bro. I just don't know what to say about it. Oh, the colors, bro, guys. Oh. Inverted colors. What am I supposed to say about this, man? How? Oh my god, my mouse is shaking. Yeah, who cares anyway? Like, what is this? Like, so many unnecessary GDI effects, bro. Oh my god, another really loud sound. I know, I'm not following this malware. I just, I'm a little bit disappointed. Let's be honest to you guys. Nah, I, I, I really don't like this malware, bro. This, this malware sucks. I don't like it, bro. It's just a GDI-based malware, bro. These malwares, bro, these malwares are just for those kids who plays Geometry Dash 24-7 and thinks that they are cool. Those malwares are for them, but not for me. Oh my god, we are getting a bunch of, like, references. I cannot even read them. Jesus, what does it say? I saw something about Clutter 666, so I guess there are references about my old projects. If you excuse me, I'm gonna drink my cup of tea. Mm. Delicious. But this is not delicious. What the fuck? My eyes hurts, bro. Oh my god, it hurts to watch this, man. Bro, can you please stop doing these effects? I would appreciate a break or something. Can you jump scare me? Please do it. I'm willing to get scared, bro. I'm dead as serious. Like, guys, what do you think about this? I'm just speechless, you know? I, I just don't know what to say about this malware. Oh my god, effects, but whatever, who cares about those effects anymore? Can we get something different, please? The this is insane, guys. No, this is bad. This is just bad malware, bro. This is, this is super uninteresting. Regardless, it is about me. I don't care. It's just a bunch of GDI effects and that's it. All right, another sound effects uh, which have been taken from Pankoza, I guess, because they they sounds really familiar to me. I don't think that he actually made them by himself. I don't trust him at all. My desktop is just a um, fucking colorful mess, you know? Oh my god, guys. Yeah, this is our community, guys, in 2025. This is our community. What? what? The fuck clutter? This device is hey. mine, not yours. Hey, Shut up! To this piece of shit, you fucking idiot. Hey, don't... Don't be rude. What the hell? What did you just say to me? I'm the... I'm your creator, Rover. I made you, bro. Oh, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> what did... What did I just say? <laughs> No, I didn't say that. I didn't say that. I meant I create you, bro. I created you. I'm your developer. Oh my god, he dared to like, you know, mock me. Oh my god, how dare you, bro? How dare you? I will not upgrade her over anymore because of this. Jesus Christ. All right, so yeah, it seems, guys, that our computer has been destroyed. Well, let's try to let's try to reboot it again, guys. Yeah, th this is what happens when you run ClutterTech.exe on your device. It will just cook your computer, show you a bunch of effects, and that's it. I expected something way more entertaining from you, Heizen. All right, guys, it contains a master boot record payload. Unfortunately, on Windows 11 we cannot see it, so let's move on to Windows XP and see what will happen. All right, so this is the master boot record payload. Well, does it contain anything else except this text? Um, well, it doesn't. Huh, what a shame. It seems you have run the clutter tech malware. You're cooked. All right, so another typo. <laughs> fix your grammar, bro. Hide some, fix your grammar, please. That, this is this is horrible. So your master boot record is corrupted. So to bad for you. What, what is this English, bro? What? I don't understand. Thanks to Cyber Soldier or Clutter to make this possible. You're welcome. Made by Hudson. Always remember, Clutter is here. Guys, guys, let's be honest to you. I don't like this malware. Yeah, uh, well, let me write this malware. Um, at least he tried. At least there were some references to me and some voice lines. So let's say uh, 3 out of 10. All right. So this malware, guys, this malware is 3 out of 10. I don't know what to say about this project. I'm super disappointed and I'm speechless. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If so, then please subscribe to my channel like this video and write a comment. Thank you and goodbye.